the news you count on. NBC2 News at 5.30. New tonight at 5.30, the local nonprofit Community Cooperative is struggling to find drivers to help deliver food in Lehigh Acres. In Florida, nearly 3 million people are food insecure. Nearly 1 million of them children. Thousands of these hungry children and adults live in our community. NBC2's Mohammed Abdul Kowi is local tonight in Fort Myers explaining why it's so hard to find drivers this time of year. Community Cooperative says that there aren't enough Meals on Wheels because volunteers are either aging out or are seasonal residents. Despite the challenges that the nonprofit is facing, workers are doing whatever they can to make sure residents receive meals. It's definitely um, uh, a greater need this year than was last year. David Johnson, the manager for Meals on Wheels at Community Cooperative, started noticing this problem about a month ago. Just from an emotional standpoint, you got to make sure that these people get their meals. From Monday to Friday, volunteers all over Lee County spend a few hours a day using their own vehicle and gas, packing meals for residents who need it. Right now, it has been difficult to find drivers for routes, specifically in Lehigh Acres. A lot of holes in our schedule that we need to fill. Brooke Flake is in charge of creating those schedules. I have 39 routes that I manage every day. She says to help fill that void, sometimes they have to pull other drivers off their usual route, or staff has to do it. But we really want to try to reach the volunteers that are in Lehigh because one of the beauties of Meals on Wheels is delivering to your neighbors. Brooke says one way or another, clients will get fed. While this is a problem right now as the summer slowly begins to start, she says that anybody can make a difference. It doesn't have to be like a constant commitment. It can even be once a week, once a month. Um, but if everybody in the community volunteered once a month, we would have all of our routes filled. If you would like to become a volunteer for Meals on Wheels, more information will be on our website. Reporting in Fort Myers, Muhammad Abdul-Kawi, NBC2.